Hi, this is Lakshmi. Today we will see about the post method and how the data is inserted through form parameters. And for that, I have used a path like insert and the method is a post annotation and consumes and produces. It consumes a F application form URL encoder and it produces a text plane. Here I have created an insert of employee insert employee method in which I am passing a form parameters like employee ID. EID, e name, employee name and e employee salary and employee department and after that I am creating a DB connection class uh, instance here and for the DB connection here I have created a class public class DB connection and where I am going to connect a database here and then next thing is after that I have created a string like query i've written a query insert into employee values so and so values all the question marks and the prepare statement is created and that for, for, for first value first question mark for set int of first this the i'm going to pass a variable which is this so like this i have set all the four values and then i am executed i executed this query query and then after that number of rows affected is the going to return it and this is how a simple example in which i am going to insert the data into a particular table and that for that i am going to execute this one in a postman here here i am going to get like giving the url as employee slash insert as it is a post method i'm selecting the post method as i have to pass the variables it is a headers like content type is a form url encoded method and the body is here i'm going to use for x y z and this is 2000 and the day 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 so after that I, if I use a send it is gone see only one row is affected that is what we have seen and for and then I, for, I want to check it whether it get employee get all employee he, as it is a get method I'm going to get select get if I send C all the data is shown here like for the employee ID 4 which I have entered here employee 4 this is inserted here this is how a form parameter is used and how it is and how the data is inserted thank you thank you for listening